Hard winters tend to darken our view of the season. We sometimes lose sight of some of the nicer sights to be had. Mike Stevens has a few in this time in this PhotoLink library. Baking away the winter blues, sometimes that's all you can do. It's what Cynthia Roth did. Pretty good way to pass a day in winter. Most of us must be content with making it through the season unless, like Sarah and Benton, we look for something to brighten things up. Perhaps admiring the design of St. Stephen's Episcopal Church main stained glass window in Wilkesbury as Troy Bank did. Or right place, right time to catch this sight pictured against a brilliant blue sky. It's from Alice Ann in Ringtown. Then there are ice crystals on the treetops like these Eileen Chorba of Beach Lake saw sparkling in the sun. Nice to see. Equally nice is Spread Out Lake and Toby Hanna glistening in the sun. Donna Digatorez caught the moment. A different lake, this one at Goolsboro State Park where Paul Grady was able to capture a sunrise. You wait around long enough and sunset happens, sometimes brilliantly. This one even made the front post light at Emily Hansa's home light up. For sure, a brilliant sunset over Honesdale captured by Teresa Cahagius. From Avis Miller in Berwick, another sunset to cap a day. Makes it one day closer to spring, doesn't it? Well now, in some places spring is popping. Arlene found one in Lewisburg. Jessica and Ralph offered us this view of the coming season in Bloomsburg. It's not quite here yet, though the welcome mat is clearly out in drums, as Shirley Turner showed us. See it, save it, send it on into us. The point is, keep looking. Spring is out there somewhere. I'm Mike Stevens in the PhotoLink Library.